Welcome back to HGTV Handmade. I'm really excited for today's DIY because it's one of my favorites. I've always loved the look of mirrored mosaics in home decor, but I've never really been big on the idea of breaking an actual mirror to create one. So today I'm recycling CDs to do this project. And I chose to do this to smaller items, but I think it would look really good on larger pieces of furniture, like the top of a table, for example. Whatever you decide to do this to, here's what you'll need to do this project. First, you'll need CDs, and I had a ton of them left over from ages ago that I'm probably never going to use again, so this was the perfect way to recycle them. You'll also need a pair of scissors and a clear glue. It can be hot glue or super glue or any other type as long as it's clear. Finally, choose whatever item you want to apply the mosaic to. It can be a box or a picture frame or a letter. Whatever you want. These items are optional, but I chose to paint my jewelry box white, so I also used acrylic paint and a foam brush. So as I mentioned, I started by painting the box white. Then I cut up my CDs and this step is much easier than I thought it would be. The scissors cut right through the CD without very much muscle involved. Just cut whatever shapes you like. I cut triangles and squares and rectangles of all different sizes. Once your pieces are cut, all you have to do is apply some glue to the plain side and then place it on your item so that the mirrored side faces up. Arrange your pieces however you'd like. This is a completely random process. After this step, I loved the result, but if you'd like to fill in the cracks between the pieces, feel free to use grout to do so. I'll leave some information about this in the description box beneath this video. And that's all there is to it. I love the result and I really want to find a white table to do this to as well. What are some of your favorite trends in home decor? I recently moved into a new place and I'm always looking for home decor inspiration, so help me out in the comment section down below. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys next Wednesday with a new video. Bye guys!